Sweet. Time to check out some new gear. That is a handheld three-axis stabilizer from Polaroid for GoPros. They sent it to me to review, so it was a free copy disclaimer. The little screwdriver, it's tiny screws that uh, you know you'll lose in two seconds. I'm actually a read the manual kind of guy. This is one of the most simple instruction manuals I've seen and uh, well laid out, um, so well done. All of the positions that the device can go in, nice thing, you can mount it on a tripod, just have a thread on the bottom, use it as a stabilizer rig like in a vehicle, so very cool. Alright, let me connect this. The batteries go in the handle, and then this contraption, this is a recharger with the little USB cable. With the rechargeable batteries, this is one thing you gotta take with you if you're going on a shoot, instead of just plugging it in directly, but whatever. So you mount it to the camera with this little thing that goes around the uh, lens, and then it's got a screw that actually has a little knob, so you don't need to have any tools with you. It's a tight squeeze, which, you know, kind of makes sense, because you don't want your camera flying, but this is gonna be a pain in the ass to get off. All right, so just balance it on the table, turn it on, and it automatically calibrates itself. Here is some sample footage from the Polaroid stabilizer. So I caved, I ended up buying the GoPro LCD backpack. I've been playing around with the rig uh, for a couple days. Sometimes I just shot blindly, which uh, worked out pretty cool. And then other times I'd use my phone as a screen, but it got to be a bit of a pain to kind of have to go walk around like this. Working with GoPro on the Polaroid gimbal stabilizer, uh, this thing has been super impressive. I've gotten like movie level shots with the device. This is about, uh, I looked it up, it's about $180, I believe, on Amazon. Yeah, the shots have been extremely impressive, extremely stable, very smooth. It takes a little, I'm still figuring out the uh, maneuvering and kind of steering the camera. If you're familiar with the movie, it's like uh, you're always in majestic mode. So the camera kind of follows a little bit with your hand movement where you point the camera, but it's still a little, um, sometimes I feel like it's like not extremely level or there's like a little bit of like extra tilt needed to tilt the camera up. But still overall like extremely impressive uh, for what it is, like really, really impressive. So I got the LCD backpack, I'm gonna slap it on, try it out, and then I'm gonna go ahead to the beach, shoot some more test footage, because uh, I'm sure you're probably tired or rolling your eyes at seeing test footage shots of people working out at CrossFit, but the only reason is because that's the most exciting thing that happens uh, in my day. All right, up and running. Do some last minute test shots of the sunset. And this stable footage is brought to you by the Polaroid Stabilizer. So final thoughts, pretty awesome rig. Uh, I did find that I can cheat without putting it on the floor and kind of balance it that way. Works out pretty well. Horizon line, eh, a little bit like that. 150 bucks, 180 bucks. 
totally worth it, totally awesome, total Moby shots. Definitely give it a thumbs up. Good for these guys, Polar Pro. So I'm at NMB last year. College kid started a GoPro company, now he's in Best Buy. <laughs>